FNN Headline News Update. Okay, folks, Larry Pesavino for TFNN Mid-Afternoon Update. We've got uh, stocks. Uh, uh, some of them are a little bit lower, like the Dow Jones and the S&P. The Russell's down just a little bit. In fact, they're all down just a little bit. I just realized that. Uh, it's the first time we've had back-to-back -back down days on Monday and Tuesday since uh, Hector's up, and that dog's 13 years old. Anyway, that's what we're looking at here today, folks. I posted a chart up here of crude oil. This is a big inflation indicator. And as you can see, we're trading at 72.84. Uh, the low today was 17, uh, 72.17. The multiple ABCD patterns that we pointed out came in at 72.22. And the market rallied $1,800, folks. And it's given back 1,200 of it. So this is not good action for crude oil today. So, uh, you know, the one thing about that is when you make it double what you risk, you at least locked in some profit. But... Uh, if we get below this level of 72, you can see there's nothing but the dark skies, well, good skies for us, down around 70.38, which would be the 78% level of the May low of uh, last year. So those are just a few of the things. Remember, this is a daily chart. Remember, this is just a couple of years ago we had the war when it was trading. Let's just get this weekly up here to show folks how things can change and it doesn't really make any difference. What the, There's the war right here. You know, there's the, there's the war. We went from 90 to 135, and if you'll remember, our good friends from someplace in New York, I don't remember. It's got a big G and a big S on the front of the building there in, uh, on Wall Street, a wall and broad. But anyway, you'll see this is what we've had to look at. And look where we are, folks. Now, we've gone from 135 down to 72. But here's what's important here with the crude oil. If you look at this without getting rid of some of these other lines that we have on here, if we take a look from the high that we made back here in March of 2022, you'll see that the rally back that we had was just a tad above the 382, a little below the 50%. This is not bullish action, folks. Uh, this certainly isn't. So we could easily make, well, you're not going to make a case for oil down here again, but you could easily say that we could go down in below 65 without any trouble at all because going back to when oil got to five dollars when they had that dude from singapore trapped and it went negative you'll see here that uh that would come in at around uh, 53 bucks so we'll see hey we're going to take a break here and uh, talk to some people here to have to call in for some really good advice and we'll send them to a place where they can get it believe it or not let's stay tuned 